It's Dapper Day 2021. I'm here scouting out the best outfits of the day at the Magic Kingdom. Hey, it's Juliet from Perfecting the Magic. You're home for the chic Disney lifestyle. Today, it's all about fashion, Dapper Day fashion. So I'm here at the Magic Kingdom. It's Dapper Day 2021. I dressed up, I'm kind of like, trying my best vintage look here. I don't normally do vintage, but I am super inspired by all the amazing fashion I'm seeing here in the park today. So I'm huffing it. We are finding the coolest outfits of the day. Come along with me. Let's see some crazy sick Dapper Day fashion. Hi, I'm Lola, the Hepburn Mume on Instagram. Hi, I'm Angel. And I'm Martin, uh, on the Dapper on Instagram. I'm Madison, I'm the Pretty Housemaid on Instagram. I'm Kenzie. I'm Monica. Could you introduce yourself to our viewers? <laughs> Uh, I'm uh, Daniel, and this is Anne Bruce Assassin. <laughs> and Estelle. And Estelle, yes. <laughs> I'm the trooper dude, and this is my wife. The lady trooper. Okay. And we gotta hear what those handles are from. I need, I need to, <laughs> yeah. Would you uh, like to explain? Uh, long story short, I bought a Stormtrooper helmet a long time ago and decided to make it into a social media profile. That was five years ago, and here we are today, dressed up dapperly as pain and... Panic. Yeah. So you came here today as part of the duo. Why don't you introduce yourself? Uh, my name is Josh. I'm with the Umbrella Fellas. We're here to show off what we love to do. Is this your first Dapper Day? Four or five? Four? I think four. Four. I think four. Is this your first Dapper Day or? Oh, it's my first. Yeah. Yeah. It's my first as well. <laughs> then, yeah. Yeah. No, not at all. This Absolutely is our not. Third, third Dapper Day. Fourth or fifth. It's like our third year doing it, but they have two a year. Is this your first time at Dapper Day? Absolutely not. No. <laughs> no, this is, I want to say, our fourth time, fourth year, something like that. You all look fabulous. So I need to hear a little bit of each of your outfits, inspiration. We are the Little Mermaid trio. So yeah. Ursula, Little Mermaid, Eric. And then she's just fabulous. Yeah, her. I'm just by myself. Yeah. <laughs> you have to tell me about these amazing outfits. I love, what was the inspiration for the outfits today? Honestly, a lot of people do bounds and things. We tend to just, you know, dress up the way we like it. Uh, we find something that's kind of fun and then try and coordinate colors as best we can. Yeah. Um, this is the best, best prop we ever made right here. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, the suit is from a company called Shinesty. There's another company called Oppo Suits. They do kind of crazy loud wild suits i got a good tailor that makes them fit my uh, trim form <laughs> and uh, there's enough left over in the pant leg to make the uh, masks we usually pick um our outfits based around wherever the dapper day event is mm -hmm. and then like an area of it so yeah they're, they're really just frontier frontier land. land we definitely pick from different eras kind of combine what would look the best in frontier land when we're physically in that area yeah we go more vintage inspired than true vintage mm -hmm. Um, to kind of take a concept and make that concept like elevate it as much as we can, even if it's not 100% accurate to whatever like era it might be. What inspired your outfits today? Yeah, oh, it's the cartoon, right? <laughs> yeah, it's the <laughs> Disney animated movie Raya and the Last Dragon. Uh, I'm Raya. I'm the Last Dragon. The Last Dragon. <laughs> I've always loved the Little Mermaid. Same. She's been my favorite. <laughs> so in my head, I wanted to capture the scene. Normally, when you see Eric's castle. Um, the ship is in port, so we made sure that the ship was out to sea and the wreckage is apparent. So the storm has passed. Um, she got her dream of becoming human and she's getting her bubble bath currently. So that is a specific moment in time right here. What made y'all want to come out today? We just love dressing this way yeah. and seeing the park all dressed up like this is so cute. Yeah, I mean, most of us dress vintage every single day, yeah. so we're going to meet people and stuff like that, so it's really cool to like be surrounded by people who dress the same way as you, you know? Yeah. Honestly, the greatest thing about Dapper Day and the Disney community is once you meet someone within the community, you're a part of the community, and that's been so wonderful. And so Pain and Panic, um, well, well, why was that picked for today? What was the... Uh... So going back to the community and the <laughs> Disney community, all the people that we've met through social media, like Instagram and Twitter and Facebook, They've become our friends, and they're people that we've met and interacted with, and they're part of Dapper Days. So we all like to bound and dapper together, and it was like, what can we do? It was like, well, we could do Hercules, and we're trying to figure out who's going to be who, and we're like, who can we be? And I'm pain because... Because he's a pain in my butt. That's right. <laughs> These are both from Unique Vintage, so they're yeah. reproduction. They're not real. <laughs> also, like the fringe we like added, this like... The scarves and like pieces are like, these are true vintage. Um, so kind of like 
pulled from different places. Here and there, yeah. Um, like true vintage gloves. We like Halloween, we like costumes. We just did like a 31 days of Halloween like challenge last year on our Instagram. So uh, we had a lot of just like costume pieces lying around. Yes. So kind of some of the stuff is that. from that, yeah. This is an original 1940s dress. What's your favorite part of coming to Dapper Day? Uh, seeing all the different looks and everything, I love how it's everybody's own Dapper. So it doesn't have to be 50s. It can be whatever it means to you. And I love seeing everybody's different looks. When you meet people on Instagram, when you meet people with a common idea like this Dapper Day, which is what we love so much, you can dress up and be a kid for a day. Yeah. And I love that. Like it's fun to dapper, <laughs> but when you can get a group of people to get together and come up with one common theme, that's what makes this great. I just love the way that it's like a community and everybody says happy dapper day and we all just talk like where did you get that? Did you make that? Like that's it's just like Disney magic but with an extra level of like friendliness and fun. <laughs> Magic Kingdom. I'm feeling so inspired by all of these looks. I think I'm going to go home and start planning my Dapper Day 2022 or next Dapper Day event look and maybe think of some kind of cool mashup Disney battle look. We'll see. We'll see what I can turn out. If you want to see up close details of all of these Dapper Day looks, um, we did a little photo shoot with each of the folks we interviewed. So you can head on over to perfectingthemagic.com to see those photos. The link's right down below. Uh, and if you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing to the channel by hitting that button right down below. I'm Juliette signing off for now. I'll see you on over at the website and of course, right here inside the park.